a deliberate attempt to mislead the Treasurer of the State and an unmanageable conflict of interest. It doesn't get much more damning than that in relation to the work of the C. The corruption watchdog has found Chris Field used the resources of the state to carry out his work as president of the International Ombudsman Institute. More than $223,000 worth of jet setting in 2022-23 alone, paid for by the WA taxpayer, even though he was doing no work as the state ombudsman on those trips. A Triple C report has uncovered what it calls a sham process, where Mr Field did not seek approval from the Premier for travel, as required. The report found Mr Field approved his own travel before the business case was created. And, of course, the business case always supported the decision he had already made. The finding of serious misconduct relates to a contract he entered into for his office to pay the OECD more than $200,000 to conduct a survey. The Triple C found when Treasurer Rita Safiotti inquired about the contract, he provided her with information falsely claiming procurement processes had been correctly followed and that the project would benefit WA. I'm disappointed with what transpired. I'm very disappointed. And I think it goes to the point that even though you're an independent authority, you have to be accountable for your actions. The Triple C found Mr Field was not motivated by greed or personal gain, but acted in arrogant disregard of his functions. But he says he was denied procedural fairness by the corruption watchdog and will request a review of its findings. Nick Perpich, ABC News.